Those who join the military do so for a wide variety of reasons. Some are lucky enough to know their calling at an early age, while others fall into it later on in life. Airman First Class, you? Airman First Class Brianna Seely is a public health technician working at Flight Medicine on Masawa Air Base. She joined the Air Force less than two years ago, but it wasn't always what she had in mind for her future. I took all the hard classes, worked really hard in high school. I had a four-year college plan set, had it all worked out. It was all the plan. And then I think my junior year was the first time I had kind of a heart attack, oh my God, real life is coming kind of thing. And my dad was like, hey, you know, if college never pans out, you know, fourth generation military would be kind of cool. And I was like, no, dad, I'm taking hard classes for a reason. All I had to do was kind of dot the I's and cross the T's on all of my college stuff. And I panicked and decided to take a year off. So I did the whole move out of the house, work odd jobs. Then one day I just decided like I didn't feel like I was doing enough without my dad knowing because I didn't want him to pull the I was right card. I went and I enlisted in the Air Force. Once things got closer and everything was kind of looking like, yes, I'm leaving for boot camp, I told my dad and he was very excited yet very upset that I didn't tell him. But it all worked out. Super proud family, lots of support back home. Grew up in a family where it was never really girls do this and boys do that. And my dad raised three girls. He was always very, they can do it, you can do it. If you're the best, you're the best. And so I always had a great support system. I think that's mainly why I'm here now. Don't want to tell him that he was right, but I think up until now, probably joining the Air Force was the best decision I've made in my life. Senior Airman Sarah Mitchell, Masawa Air Base, Japan.